distinguished Toastmasters, fellow youth leaders, and guests, a good evening to one and all. Good evening. Now, if social media was banned for a week, I would be the happiest person. Because um, recently, um, in the, the break, it just went spring break, I really wanted to go to the Ferrari world, and the first person who said no was my father. And guess why? Because he had lots of work to do. So I will be the happiest because, um, like, after my dad comes from the office, he the first thing he does is open his laptop and say it's stop working. So um, I would be really happy if my father stops working and enjoys for a few moments, right? Like all all the parents today are very focused on working, earning for the children, and wanting the best. But at this time, they forget that they too have a life to live. The children want to enjoy too, not just study. Right? So I would, I would uh, go to Ferrari World the first two, three days, enjoy there, and then the, the, I think the fourth day would be, would be spent on playing table tennis. I love playing table tennis, and uh, since there's no social media, I guess we won't have to study for some days, right? Because I don't, I don't think uh, social media in the sense, um, Facebook and Gmail, we do um, send each other a lot of notes and stuff. So. I think uh, social media, if social media would be banned, I would stop studying for a bit of time and actually start enjoying myself. So um, the rest of it is, I'll think about it later, I guess. <laughs> so if social media would be banned, I, the first thing I would be, I would enjoy myself. And yes, I would go for Ariel. That's the first thing I would do. Um, over to you.